Then over time, you know, their lack of results can sometimes cause them to lose confidence and slide into sort of the 16, 32. Right. Sometimes you see those guys wash out. Sometimes they give up the game even. Problem X has found a way to elevate yeah, and through you know, all of his challenges. Uh, what you were talking about a little bit earlier, some people don't even think about that either. When you play your first, when you're the first match on top eight, when you win, you actually don't play your second one yeah. until quite some time. It's a long time, and staying hot is really important in this game. Mm -hmm. uh, having a chance, to, it's a sort of a, the tension between having a chance to sort of think and reflect, to breathe, to drink some water, and also the chance to stay hot. And I think it affects different players differently. I do think Problem X is a very self-aware player, uh, a lot of mental composure. Hopefully he's able to recover there and up against Fudo. You know, also been on a break. Right. But the funny thing about this is that, you know, he has watched Fudo play against Abigail again. Mm. So now, you know what? I'm, I'm just, he's going to go with Bison here. So. Yeah, he does play both characters at uh, tournament level. All right. Well, look at this pressure right away starting from Problem X. Looks super comfortable. I like the uh, jump in option. Because, again, part of what makes Bison so effective on the ground is a lot of focus there around expectations. Ooh, that slap, that psycho axe from Bison. Such a crucial button. Finds the EX. Not able to combo. And to confirm oh. into the corner. Smart stuff there yeah, from Yeah, gets to the other side. Oh, oh wow. Speaking of the other side. No one was expecting that one. And beautiful. He had that combo all set up to make sure he keeps the wow. corner, gets the stun. Wow. Well, does the microphone for fun. And I see filthy Mika players in the audience clapping. <laughs> clapping for that nastiness. Uh, but shout out, major shout outs to Fudo for cracking the code, finding a way to jump in, and surprise problem and just extreme focus on the ground play. Yeah, and Lurik, you saw right there, Bison, Problem X counter poking with that standing light kick, one of the most important buffs that he got now. Three frames on that. And look at this, not letting Fudo out of the corner, still Blocking. slapping away, reaching with that heavy punch Blocking again. Both B reversals, forcing him to use it just to avoid stun. But here comes Fudo, mid screen, doesn't overcommit. Oh, yeah, oh, again. The mic again. You just forget that it has armor a lot of it's, times when you see it. It lingers so long. I like the weight oh, in the air. Wow. Okay. Problem X with the full confirm into the kill combo right there, and tying I, it up one to one. I really like that because it was a more complete match. It wasn't just bullying or the giant combo, it was a series of good decisions from Problem X. Wow, nice punish showing that he's got the charge to be able to punish those fake charge roundhouses. Oh man, counter poke with that standing light punch beating <laughs> That's a total Fudo move. Yeah. yeah. That's what we call oh, the 1%. And I like him using the crouching heavy punch because it has so many active frames that it's right. almost guaranteed to punish the teleport. Oh, he's in there. And so yeah, the, the, the drop kick right away. And I love it. You see that? He did the B reversal, was charging for the head stop that the entire time. time. Yep. Now here's been the death of him previously. Great throw break. And again, oh. he just wants out, gets the trade advantage, and just opts to yeah. jump away. Smart. Going Corner. to the other side. And so critical in Street Fighter V. When you're moving oh, options are limited. bad timing on that attempt to catch him when he landed. I wasn't expecting Fudo to actually hit a button. Oh, what the, heck? the double dash, it caught him. He was trying, that was you exactly what dead. Problem X was trying to avoid. He's like, that's what I'm worried about. I gotta get out of here. Not fast enough. Oh, man, the damage on that is so high. Fudo now. Trying to get himself into Grand Finals. That's what it would be. Can he get himself back to the promised land of a Grand Finals? He took Street Fighter IV after two years of back-to-back -back of Daigo winning Street Fighter IV. Problem X representing not just the UK, but the hopes of European Street Fighter. Luffy been able to make his mark on the top eight stage here at EVO. Problem X playing some of the best Street Fighter of his life, but now Fudo just running him over. Nice back dash. Mm, he could have punished oh, wow. that command throw a lot. That problem stand short, oh. shutting down. Oh, so good. <laughs> so good, James. Oh, that stun. Guess what? Fudo now. Mm. Mm. And there now it's starting to get worried for Problem. Yes. I feel like he's got he's to gotta switch it up a little bit. And that is one thing outside of the beat trigger with some of the craziness, like activation. Bison has a little bit of a hard time switching up his game plan. It's a very strong game plan, but not super flexible. You know you're going to be throwing those normals. You know you're going to be poking with the PX. Oh, and the counter hit in this time. And guess what? Almost done. Almost dizzy. Yeah. Oh, but you know, it's a reset in yeah. the air, and I don't think he was expecting that. But Fudo was right oh, on it. Nice. Nice punish. And 
now, thanks to a little bit of a change, he gets the it. EX scissors Very after clean. that, and a nice throw to finish Very that round. Very clean, good stuff, nice recovery from Problem. After Fudo looked like he was maybe gonna run wild. And now look at the respect for both players. Yeah. And that's one of the nice things about Bison, his heavy scissor kick is the best one for him to get in on the opponents. So, Problem X hides the charge there so it is. well. Surprising him. Said it looked like an opportunity to dash, and it wasn't. Oh, I'd love to see that neutral jump to punish. Uh, that neutral jump to punish the charge roundhouse. Ooh. Wow, good counter move. Oh, he cuts what counter. A timing. And now keeping that pressure. And that's Bison. He's such a momentum character. He hits you with that, and all of a sudden, all the punches start coming out. <laughs> he still confirmed wow. off of That's it! That's about the max damage you could get. Problem X intentionally trying to get into the air to avoid some of the worst damage he might eat. Tried to walk under, but Fudo coming down with a body spot. Oh no! Oh, input error. Very That's rare stuff from Fudo. Crucial input error. They definitely didn't mean to do the command throw. But can Problem take advantage of it? Oh, so much gray health taken out over there. Bison's B reversal is terrible. Very slow, but sometimes oh, necessary. Oh, look at this pressure right now. Oh, that's going to be punishable. punishable. There oh, it is. Punish. Wow. Again, Fudo looking a little shaky. Very so, rare input error, and then the EX. He was hoping. He knew. He knows the exact same thing that I said, right? So Bison players, when they get inside, they like to start hitting buttons. Yep. So he went with the armor he right there. Trying to eat one of those buttons and power through. Problem. Found the right time. Locked Take it down it, a notch. Yeah, locked it, and uh, that's one of the hardest things to do as a player when you get that offense. You just want to go in, in, yep. in, in, but yep. he found the right time to hold back a little bit. He gave him a window and called that enough rope to hang yourself. Yeah. Impressive stuff from Problem X, and that's the kind of stuff you don't see from players who are pretty good or who've mastered, <laughs> mastered the basics. That's some next level mind game stuff. That's some championship type of play. Oh, challenging the drop kick. Now back to the neutral here. Both of them now trying to jockey for that position. The whole goal of your neutral is to find a way to give yourself the advantage. Find yourself to, to find a way to get yourself the opportunity to apply a mix-up. And I love the pace changes here from Problem X. Sort of hanging back and going in hard. Mm -hmm. Building some gray life, getting little stray hits. But again, nothing kudos. Oh no! Oh, that's gonna be a wow. big punish right there. Yeah. Feels strange to say that Bison's fireball getting punished for the jump in, <laughs> yeah. but that's exactly what happened. Oh, but activation, activation time, and he has a lot of meter. He has two bars. Oh, Isn't enough, not no. quite enough. Just short, but he finds but it on the back. you know what? He did the scissor kick, which has the teleport at the start. Looked like he was going to the other side. Fudo turned the controller around to block the dash. So smart. Beautiful stuff right there from Problem X. Covers the back dash option and the bait. So good. Pressure. Oh, what? Wow. Really? Fudo said not today, my friend. This guy just loves landing this critical art, man. I'm He's telling been you. He's tired of that bullying. He actually has said, Fudo has actually said that he uses that critical art as a one time high damage uppercut. That's, that's, how, he, yeah. he, that's how he looks at it. And there it was right there. Oh, no. Trying to stop the drop kick. Didn't have the right timing. So difficult to challenge that drop kick. Now more than ever with the fake on the table. And well represented by Fudo. But again, Problem X taking great advantage of these ranges. Ooh. Oh, again, another execution error is going to cause a little problems. Yes, wow. throw it. But he did the long Nadesco. Yep, and he still jumped into it. Oh, big oh, damage. The oh, that's going to be it. That's going to be it. It's going to be 2 1. Mouse for Problem X. Wow. He is trying to give Europe another EVO championship. Luffy, the first one for the major Street Fighter series. Trying to take it home for the UK. And that's good. He's got, that's a good face right now. I like that face. Yes. You can see some tension, but also the composure. I believe in this man. This is my dark horse. This is the guy I said could go the distance. He was one of my dark horses at Capcom Cup last year as well for very much the same. And you know what the crazy thing is? Like you said, it was the last six months that he He's kept getting better. Really just gotten better in a way that most players stall out of that place. He's continued to accelerate. I have a lot of respect for what he's done. Yeah. Really trying to get past that wall of being, you know, a gatekeeper at a tournament into a potential champion. That's right, but now he's going to be put in the corner. Oh, oh wow. the crush. Super smart and the dizzy. 
And he went with a jump heavy punch to make sure it was maximum stun damage right there. That wouldn't have been it if he'd done it on the ground. Oh, stayed in the front, and now because... Oh! The wingless, yes. yeah. Because he charged up the microphone also, that did a little extra bit damage. extra damage. Yeah. Yep. Fudo trying to take it back two to two. And again, that focus on the ground game. Sometimes gonna get caught by those surprise jumps. Ooh, just out of range, the Irish whip. Nice. Back into mid-screen, open waters. Good challenge with the jabs. Oh, nice, the three light confirm from Fudo. Great technical stuff there from Fudo. Says, I just, oh, I love the idea, but timing a little bit off. Yeah, but it wasn't too bad, though. I mean, he could have got hit by the Psycho Axe, but just a little too far. Oh, the oh, jump man. in! Oh, oh but another but it, drop. Fudo himself feeling the pressure. Yeah, Fudo has had a couple of execution here so far. Guess what? Beat trigger activation time. Oh. But Problem X dropped something, but this time cuts the other side. Here comes the damage. Which side is he oh, on? The side switch switch. again. That's going to do it. Match point for Problem X again in the grand finals. Woo. <laughs> oh, the second switch. He just did it again. He was he was counting on the fact that Fudo didn't think he would do it twice. James, I really like the way this guy is playing. Oh I, yeah, I am a happy man. Uh, Fudo again, not ready to go quietly into the night, waking up with the jabs. Yeah, he only needs to win one round, and it's tied up all of a That's sudden. That's exactly right. So it feels like dangerous for Fudo right now, but he's really not that far behind. Just one round. But it really feels like Problem X has been kind of outplaying him a lot of this game. I would say so. He's controlling the range. This is a tough match for Mika in some ways. Well, a little too fast. If that jab hadn't hit that throw mm -hmm. timing, would have been right. Oh, no. But hit out of the air. Very fortunate for Problem X. Now spends a bar for the V reversal. So that means it's going to be very hard for him to get a trigger. Because Bison cannot land his V skill like ever. He hasn't depended. Oh! oh. Big damage. Crush counter will help him build a little bit of that V-Gage. Nice counter post. Oh, but oh. it's still oh, there. Oh, Nadesco challenges it, but I not too like, bad. Oh, oh wow. Okay. okay, not dead, but very, very close. It's very so close. tough to put Fudo in a scramble situation. His homework really pays off. Oh, but slide into V-Trigger. Too far, too oh, far. No. Oh, he flinched. He flinched. He thought he was going to go for the throw. He didn't see it as soon as that crouching yeah. light hit, hit. It almost looked like a punch to the yeah. gut from uh, to, to Problem X. He just doubled over. over, yeah. And now, yeah, he's gone from match point now to even up. And that's a big mental swing. Here we go. So this is to find out who gets in the grand finals. It's Problem X and Fudo. Let's go! Dash up jab, great completion. Solid pressure. Very composed game plan. This is exactly the game that Problem X wants to play right now. Mm -hmm. And that's the beautiful thing about that cycle yep. ball right there. When you hit him out of the air, we've seen so many times someone gets punished. But yeah, you're not negative on weird hit out of the air. He's playing his game. Oh, oh he spelled yeah, it. He was just waiting. He's, that's all he was looking for was that dash. And one of the tricky things about Mika is he has a lot of weird ways in. Drop kicks, slide, dash. And Problem X so smart after Mika throws out the fake roundhouse. He didn't fight. Mm -hmm. He's playing super composed. Good decisions here. Oh, nice counter pokes from Fudo. Here we go. Gets Pop that X frame advantage. Oh, there wow. it is. The counter poke into the scissor kick. That three frame light kick. So good. So fast. And match point again for Problem X. Fastest moves in this game are three frames. So it's so important to have that a move at that speed. Who will await in the winner's finals? Oh, that's going to be a punish for Fudo. And, and Max damaged it as well. A lot of corner carry. And again, pushing him in there using the armor. Confirm. Double jump for the meaty. Yep. Goes Good for block. the crush. Oh. oh. Confirm. Fudo never misses that. Confirm. Back to the corner you go. Here comes the mix up. Good blocks. Pop Max is trying to get some space. Use the activation. Other Auto. side. Didn't cancel that into the scissors, though. It's break, like he break. wanted to save the meter. Oh, oh! At the last second. Guess what? Last game. Last round. Here we go. Who's going to grand finals? Europe's last hope, the UK. I mean, anything not in Japan's last hope right now. <laughs> Can anyone stop the Japanese from sweeping in to the finals? Oh, oh gets the crush. crush. Counter. And Both another crush reversal. counter. What is going on? How many kills? The pressure almost the done. Humanity. Oh, oh, he the did DP. it. Oh, 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 Guess oh, who is so going to be going to the grand so finals? It is Problem X.
He's going to grand finals over Fudo! I'm reeling. I'm reeling a little bit. That was so smart. So smart, you got hit with it once, not twice, my friend, already in the air. There's no reason to go in the air unless you thought that was exactly <laughs> what was gonna happen. Fool me once, shame on me, and fool me, no, shame on, man, you don't forget it. I hate that. James, that's why you're here with